In the world, there are approximately 300,000 children who are diagnosed with cancer every year. So it is actually still a relatively rare cause of illnesses in children, but it is a leading cause of death in many children across the world. Cancer in children, what we know is that it is caused by a mutation in the cell that is uh, spontaneous. So what I mean by spontaneous mutation is that there is no known cause for it. It just happens that the cell misbehaves and continues to grow uncontrollably and causes a cancer. As opposed to a germline or inherited mutation, where you have this gene that is present in the ovary of the woman or the testes of the men, and it is passed on to their child, and the child can inherit that germline mutation and can cause a cancer. So germline mutation causes for cancer only account for about one to two percent of all uh, childhood cancer. There is no known risk that smoking or tobacco exposure to children cause cancer. But because smoking can affect or smoking exposure can affect a child in terms of um, growth and development and breathing problems and respiratory diseases like asthma, it is not a good idea to smoke around any child. Another common myth is that uh, children cannot tolerate treatments like chemotherapy or radiation therapy. But actually it is also very wrong because children tolerate treatments that we need to give them for their cancer much better than adults. One very important and interesting fact about childhood cancer is that it can be cured and in many cancers that occur in children, we can cure up to 80% of them. And if you look commonly, the most common childhood cancer, which is acute leukemia, we can cure up to 98% of children with cancer at this moment.